Hey guys, what's going on? Just a quick little summoning video today because I don't really have all that much to talk about. I am planning on doing a little guide for the uh, Titans, not really a guide for them, but like the uh, farmable units and the good units you can farm and such later on, but I didn't really have time today to compose all of that information and stuff, so hopefully I'll be able to get that out tomorrow. But for today, we're just going to summon a little bit. We only have 27 high eggs here, uh, water one, and we also have our Astromon League eggs. So we're gonna go ahead and go to the Astromon League and do that first. I only have 800 uh, tokens left, really need to start doing Astromon League more. I have 10 out of 10 tokens at the moment, but I did do them like this morning, so it's just, it's all good. I believe the gleams and the eggs come to a total of 700, so we're safe for this week, no problem. Not bothering to get the snowy, the dark snowy, I believe I have 16 again after my Evo 3 light one. If we wanted to, we could Evo 3 a dark one also. I am going to wait till the event ends because I would like a light snow, a second light snowy, I guess. I'm not too sure. Haven't totally decided yet if I would go for another light snowy if I got it. But I'm going to make that decision when the event's over. Regardless, here we go. We're starting with our first high secret egg here. Got the volume up a bit so we can hear the dings. Ding! Oh god, that's kind of loud. Okay, turn the volume down a little bit. We got a Mona. Uh, okay, we're gonna be moving on to the high fire egg now. Let's do this. Sing! Next one's a fire hunter. All right, moving on. Four star would be nice. It's been a while since we summoned. We're not doing as many golems. Ding! These days because of uh, farming snowies. We got a water shelly. All right, that's actually pretty cool. I may actually raise another water shelly because of the uh, Titan boss. He is so good there with that 100% death down. They do resist sometimes, but uh, ding! Not really all that often. I also did raise a light miho. I have the Evo 3 light, dark, and wood now, I believe. Light isn't as good because it only has a tack down on its active, and even then it's only 60% chance, but it is a natural four star. Should, should have solid stats, you know, and pretty easy to Evo 3. We're kind of saving our gleam for now. I'm not totally sure yet. I may get a gleam for my Anu if I find one more in story mode so I can get my light anu to evo 3. I know they are farmable but legendaries for me are so freaking rare like I can run a thousand two thousand runs and not find one. It's been a long time since I found an, an anu so might just use a gleam for the last one if I find one. If not then I'm probably going for my dark cupid. Regardless uh sorry for all the talking we're gonna get on to the high egg summons now. It's a little bit bad though because we only have three free spots so before we do anything I'm gonna try and free up some spots. Why do I have this many cosmos again? Are you serious? I suppose I'm gonna go ahead and make three evo two dark snowies to free up some space because i assume we'll be able to get one more snowy before the event ends since we have 15 at the moment and just in case we get a light one then i'll save three evo ones dark snowy actually isn't all that bad uh for the titan with 70 percent attack down it is only for one turn so it's not that great but it will have better stats than something like this light kilobat here i just raised recently i already had an evo three light kilobat and i thought this dude's useless i'm never gonna use him but then i had to raise an entire new one because of the Guild Titan, 100% attack down is going to be very, very useful. Already getting kind of halfway into my uh, Titan guide thingy. Ding! Ooh, another egg. And gems. Ding! More gems. Ding! More gems. All right, well, we cleared up 20 spots. It should be enough for now. Maybe some of those 20 can be used to fuse in other places. Let's just go ahead and start and see what happens. Ding! Candling. Ding! Hunter has a single target active skill, so it might be pretty good for the Titan as well. We'd have to recheck all their skills. Ding! Mona. Ding! Another Hunter. Ding! Ah, Beth is another interesting, actually interesting, not a meme this time. Uh, Beth, also single target active, can do 100% more damage against the element it's strong against, so actually, uh, definitely an idea to raise for the Titan. Ding! A variant Mandragora, okay. Ding. Mini cat. Yes! I forgot to do the first ding, this is why this happens. I did actually also raise a fire Leo to Evo 2, although I'm actually not sure if, if I want to go for the fire or the wood Leo. I would need like one or two more Leos before I could Evo 3 one or the other, but I haven't really decided. Drop that down in the comments below. I know fire Leo can do tons of damage, wood Leo is more of a tanky debuffer, but I can't really tell who would be better for the Titan. I, yeah, I'm kind of really into the Titan now, really like the battles and such. So when I'm looking at units, I'm always asking myself if they'd be useful for the uh, Titan or not. Debuffers and damage dealers are probably the two most important types. Uh, debuffers as in defense down and attack down. I don't know, maybe I'll raise both of them for now. First four star, pretty cool, pretty cool, let's move on. Ding! I have seen enough of you. Maybe I shouldn't do ding, maybe ding kind of curses it, I have no idea. Let's try. 
Oh my god, what the hell? Are you serious? <laughs> uh, okay, oh man. A tiger. Uh, well, this one has Def Down on its 5 star skill. So if I'm gonna raise one, it'd probably be this one, since Def Down is useful also. I was definitely not impressed with any of them as far as I remember. I just remember not being too enthused in, in my Tiger review video, but I think that might just because I was expecting more. Basically, they're average 4 stars. So maybe they're not bad, they're just average. <laughs> No ding. Kokomaru is still pretty good though. I'm not totally sure if I'm still going for fusion, but uh, it's kind of nice. Another candling. Let's continue up. <laughs> nah, nothing. Did I say nothing? Did I actually say nothing? Look at this miracle. Ding. Got a Miho here. Not sure. I have like two other Evo 1 Dark Mihos. Maybe I'll raise a second Dark Miho. Uh, it's not, I know it's not really that awesome, but uh, resist leads are kind of important for some titans. Ding! Candling. Ding! Another hunter. Ding! Got a crow hook up in here. Let's uh, keep going. T uh, 11 left. Ding! Mandragora. Ding! Another Miho. It's, it's alright. Ding! Get out. Oh, guess we gotta do some things. Well, I have four tigers now, so I could actually make one of them Evo 2 already, because I am no, I'm not using gleams on them. Well, I might actually go for the wood one, since he's an attacker and can do more damage on his three-star skill. Also, he's a wood type, and I'm very much lacking on wood units. No square, but I'm sure I wouldn't go through the effort of giving him a ruin set and a crit rate gem and all that anyway. Gonna throw that siren into that siren, this fibs into that fibs, these kokomaru's into that kokomaru. Well, probably the only Beth I'd actually go for is the fire beth since it's a balance type and the other two are tanks get a really good wood killing team in there i think i rebirthed an evo 2 fire beth in one of my earlier videos kind of regret that now i'm just gonna release some cosmos beep 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 20 astrogems not bad back to summoning Ding. yeah we got a fibs we can continue raising our wood fibs oh does the fire one also have death break i should have checked them ding. monkey no ding the no ding didn't work this time, we got a Miho. Come on. Mona, thinking about raising a water Mona also, not too sure yet. Ding. Another candling. I think the fire candling, yeah, death break on both skills, 60%. Selectively about as good as wood Fibian, I guess, so who knows, might raise one of the- I have a lot of fire units and a lot of fire units I'm raising also, so. And then again, we never have trouble with the wood titan. I think we have a lot of strong fire astromons in, in the clan. Ding, come on. Another Kokomaru, we got two eggs left, plus a this water egg over here. No ding. Come on. Okay. Mona, one left. Quick. Another Shelly though. Uh, yeah, cool. Uh, now our special high ocean egg. It must be a natural five star water Persephone, please. Okay, it's not a water Persephone. It's probably almost a water Persephone though. Yeah, it's a water Miho. It's probably better than a water Persephone. Yeah. Sure. Gonna do this to get a bit of space back so we can open up the best eggs we saved for last. Oh, variant. Oh yeah, look at him go. Very nice, very nice. Yeah. Well, that wraps up this summoning video. Uh, that wasn't all that great, I guess. Uh, we got a Leo. Pretty much the best thing we got out of this session, I suppose. Got some other three stars that we can fuse. It's okay, all around, guess. Gonna release a sparkler. What you gonna give me? Okay. Another cupid would have been nice. Need either three more cupids or gleams to get this bad boy to Evo 3. Looking forward to that. But yeah, I guess that'll do it for today. Make sure to drop a like if you did enjoy. I would really appreciate it. Thanks, as always, for watching. And until next time.